welcome back to Name Pending Plays Ocean Horn. Yeah, yeah, we went into here and there's nothing. Yeah. Except you, you, the ground collapsed under their feet. <laughs> and I knew this, and it was making it so much better. <laughs> Whee! So this is when you're supposed to use the spin attack to kill three enemies at once, because each of those counts as an individual enemy. Stupid. It's amazing. This you, is the boss. Yes. Boring boss. Really? Suddenly it seems less boring. <laughs> Cool, you've given them a swarm. Boring boss, is it? Yeah, I'll show you for calling me boring. <laughs> you got your one experience back. Maybe you should try staying in oh, attack. I, for I forget how you swing attack. You hold down the button. It's a Zelda game, come on. You know that. Now walk into the crowd. If you go three at once, you get an achievement from another island. Oh. Wait. Okay, guys, remember how I was supposed to be uh, supposed to be fighting this boss well? You called it boring. <laughs> um, I'm forgetting his name. Uh, see, oh, Mink? No, no, no. Oh, York? I'm asking York. York. York, help! <laughs> Come on, I thought you liked Shakespeare. You know York's name. The last four going. Bjorg bored me. Really? Bjorg bored you. The dead guy. In Hamlet. As opposed to the other dead people in Hamlet. Okay, so I died like three times, but hey! It's okay. They saw it. We're not coming yet. Yep. Good. <laughs> you are a pilgrim. <gasps> I'm religious now? <laughs> yes. <laughs> you got your item. You worship Sol and Luna. <laughs> the Adventurer's Guild even gave us Oh, hey, look, we lost. So yeah, that was the boss. It's okay, we're gonna have a much more interesting boss in the next dungeon. We're gonna have a real boss fight soon. This was much more like a mini boss. Hey, look, a chest. I wonder if there are bombs inside it. Oh, wait. There's a heart. I don't know where are the bombs, I don't remember now. <laughs> They're in a different room, right. Well, we're that much closer to 100 percenting this game. Did I, did I go the wrong way? Yes. Yes, you did. Oops. <laughs> I forgot about this wrong way existing. It's useful for in the fight because you could just go grab that heart. That's the entire point of it? I think so. <laughs> oh, this is the right one. You can just skip the centipedes, can't you? I think you can. But why would you? Because apparently you can't survive. Like me. You're very good at this game. I'm not, I'm not good at RPGs. <laughs> A box! That sounds like Mother 3 music. Oh good, it's ripping off You more found stuff. the boom! <laughs> Use bombs on enemies and any weak looking surfaces or objects you come across. It's okay. Not all weak things can be killed. Not all weak things. <laughs> so, all the miners are dead. Yep. Pull up their boxes! That's the purpose of it? Yes, you're supposed to learn to use your bombs now. It's a tutorial. Run away, it'll hurt you. No, it won't. Okay, if you say so. <laughs> you yeah. found a rare seashell. By the way, I like to imagine that you don't actually have the coins yet. You're going to trade this in at the store when you're using it. So it's like you're just going to have a collection of that old boot, the seashell, and some coins. <laughs> <laughs> Because it's giving you five points now, but I think that's what you value it at. I think it's actually worth less. I have to blow my way out to get out of here? Yep. You gotta blow it up. You gotta make it explode. Because it's your fit. Because you, like that other guy, love bombs. Yeah. You know, we're going to go and visit King James in Parliament and show him how cool those bombs are. <laughs> I mean, we became a pilgrim. Of course. The pilgrims were often Puritans. Yes. And? I don't see where you're going with this. Well, I mean, actually, I don't think Guy Fox was a uh, Puritan. Wait, wait, you can, you can go up there to that button. Button? Yes. Boudons? Yes! Bouton? No. Ah. <laughs> we are really writing the most intelligent commentary possible. <laughs> 
There's a rat. Yeah. Ow. It's a trainer. Ow. Why are you saying ow? Because I believe in sympathy. No, I don't. Die! <laughs> oh, the music cuts out for this part of the cave. Because you're not in an intense cave anymore. Hey, look, I got a bomb from that. I oh. loved another one. Aw, it exploded. <laughs> You, your cousin didn't give me a bomb. Well, he did, but he didn't let me keep it. I think it's, it's stuck in the wall. Yeah, it's like on the wall. Th th there's some logic behind this game that that neither of us will ever understand. Mm -hmm. It's called it being an indie phone game from 2013, 2012. Also, anyway, there was no wall. In the oh, hey, look, Diafel kept me in prison in the Winterlands. Okay. Hi, it. Ophelia! <laughs> <laughs> no, that's Hamlet. We're gonna call that guy Hamlet when we meet him, and he won't understand. And trust me, I can tell you who that person is. I actually know who sent that letter in the bottom. The Ophelia one or that one? That one. We don't know who the Ophelia one was? No, we will never find out. Actually, I think it's the Master Adventure. I'm pretty sure it is the Master Adventure because he leaves no skin of Ophelia. So yeah, the Master Adventure is Hamlet. Well, I mean, of course he is. He he went adventuring with pirates for a bit. That legitimately happened in Hamlet. You'll read Hamlet. Yeah, I know what happens in Hamlet. I'm just telling our audience that that legitimately happens. He goes and joins some pirates for a bit mm -hmm. on his way to be executed. <laughs> and they just take him back. Yeah. And then Rosencrantz and Guildenstern die. Yep. Too bad for them. They're nice. Their names go well together for some reason. Yeah, and there's a whole play about them being dead. Very existential. <gasps> My cousin! By the way, that's a dire folk. Your cousin's a dire folk. And your uncle is a dire folk as well. Yeah, do feel too tough. <laughs> that's a weird relation. I'm sure it's not. I'm sure that you're a dire folk, and I'm not racist, so I, I accept that. <laughs> Why wouldn't I accept it? It's okay, you don't have to hide that you're a dire folk anymore. No, no! That was intentionally what I was trying not to do, but it wasn't <laughs> letting me push it the way I wanted to go. It's okay. You can fix it now. I just realized I could have just pushed it back. Yeah. Also, I just jumped. Yeah. Jumped is not supposed to be allowed. Oh, hey, look. I don't know what's in this part of the island. I knew you are. Mainly because I've never been here. <laughs> I've been here like once or twice. Oh, it's back here. We're back here again. It's towards the entrance. Huh. Like the mine. I mean, the intense cave. Maybe that grass will give you your health back. I don't like you, Jeff. <laughs> now you really don't like it. Bird! Aw. It's dead now. Cousin! You you know how I've been having... Like, do you want to pay for my medical bills again, cousin? <laughs> no? Well, fine. I'll give you some experience for it, though. You need to gain experience in how the world really works. You can't just do that. Okay, yeah, he's gonna be a pain for you. Oops. More than that! <laughs> I would suggest re-equipping your shield by going into the... Yeah, that. There's a fast way to do it. Yeah, that, yeah, that, the item button. There's also the slow way where you hit the mini-map, which is the way I usually use. Because it's also how you equip magic. Also, you do that one, too. Now I think of it. He killed his friend again. Both times we've seen him, he's killed that one. You're gonna try and figure this out again, aren't you? Mm hmm I must. You did it! And still, we don't know what to do. Uh, and... you might have to be walking towards me. Nope, that has killed me before. Hmm. Yeah. Then and... I think they just wanted it to be random and couldn't think of I don't think, yeah, I don't think they were able to, I'm sure they had, like, something in mind that, it, that does work, which is probably really hard to trigger. 
So I have faith in their uh, ideas, just less in the execution of them. Yeah, I think walking towards it might be the best way. Because at least then if it goes off to the side, you're more likely to hit it. I don't understand those blue guys at all. Those little blue things? Yeah, I don't understand why they exist either. Add detail to the world, I guess? I guess. Oh. Yeah. We're gonna have to go back around this way. Apparently we're gonna have to go all the way around. Okay, so that's what that gets us. <laughs> I've never come back. Um, Wait, is it becoming night time? No. Why you get darker? Oh, that's your... That's your... That's the phone brightness auto-adjusting angle. Probably. Something I should have turned off before this. Oh, well. Uh, it's not doing it on the recording. So okay. oh. Friend, friend. You can go down over there to get to where you're going. You have a good, you have a kind of a bit of a backswing there when you do that. It's dangerous when you're fighting enemies in front of you, but it helped you there, so I'm not gonna complain too much. What? How a backswing? No, you did. You were hitting the enemy behind you. Yeah. I'm saying you have a bit of a backswing there, which... No, I was intentionally doing that. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, he was behind you. Wait, you're gonna go through the mine to get there? Oh, you're just walking this way. Okay. I have no idea what I'm doing. I can tell. Well, I actually think I'm supposed to go this way. So. Yeah, you are, this is the way you're supposed to leave. Hey, look, a radio! I don't like this song. There's so many bad songs. And yes, viewers, you can insert whatever bad song you want in your mind. Yeah, we're not talking about the game music. The game music's okay. The game music's amazing, actually, most of the time. It does have some bad music on it. Well, not bad. It has music... There's at least one song that really doesn't fit the rest of the soundtrack, and I'm sure you will point it out when we get there. And if you don't, I will. When I was walking on a hill nearby, I fell in a hole. I saw something dark, but I was too afraid to start climbing. We, we've already talked to you, haven't we? This sounds familiar. Uh, so, have uh, we done everything we need to? Yep, for now. I don't think we can get anything else on the island. Let me check. So that's what happened in the mine. A giant centipede. Did. Seepede? Seepede? That is horrible. I care so much. I guess it's time for my retirement. I've always dreamed of having my own boat. Yeah, we'll probably have to come back here later. Hold on. We'll come back here later when we're actually collecting the bloodstone actively. It'll make for a fun couple episodes. That, that's the way for going into the island. Bomb Island. Boom Island. Thank you. <laughs> Where's our boat? It, it's that way. This it's the, yeah, over here. I, I'm gonna point out things out on there because it's just because it's just better that way. <laughs> Almost there. There it is. You have to go. You can't. You can't climb in from the water. You're not a good enough swimmer. Wait, really? You yes, can? yes, you can. <laughs> I have never done that. Let's see how much percentage we've actually completed the island. Just tap on the island. Seventy-eight. Yeah, that's pretty good. We'll come back. Yeah. We have to come back. All right. Yeah. Alright guys, and that's the shorter episode, but we finally completed what we were doing on Bomb Island. So, what we're going to do now is tap the open sea, apparently. Yeah, we're just going oh, to... Oh, Bomb Island. Not to be confused with Bomb Island in Wind Waker. We're just going to travel the open sea. And that's the end of the episode. We're just going to end it while we're sailing. Yep. See you next time. I'm Remsad14. That's our winner, because, yeah... Yep. And this is Name Pending Plays Ocean Horn. Remember to like and subscribe. Even if you don't like and hate us. Yep. Please. See you <laughs> next time.